thank you so much for staying with us on this beautiful Wednesday edition right here with me. I have my first interview um, about to commence. And uh, with me, I have Professor Kola Olaya. Welcome to Wake Up Nigeria. How are you doing this morning, sir? I'm good. It's a really wet much. morning. I hope it didn't disrupt your morning. Uh, no, I mean, routine. we managed to get it. We managed to get here. Amazing. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. tell me, tell me about yourself. Because, I mean, going through your bio, you seem to literally be pretty vast in a lot of things. So tell me yeah. about yourself. Yeah. Well, um, my name is Kola Olaya. I am a U.S. Fulbright scholar. Okay. Um, I'm an American Nigerian. Okay. I teach uh, in uh, the university in the U.S. Anderson University. Okay. So I'm I'm in Nigeria uh, as part of the you know international education exchange between uh, you know sponsored by the U.S. government. Okay. So my intention is to I'm in Nigeria to research Nollywood. Nollywood. Yes. Okay. Okay. So now, what is the aim for this particular research? What are we? What's the target? What are we trying to find out with this research? What area? Yeah. Really what I intend to? to do is that I'm looking into um, how Nollywood represents you know, women. Okay. Um, it's, you know, there's a lot of things going on in Nigeria and there's a lot of cultures and I, I want to look at, you know, the cultural attitudes, mm. uh, you know, again, that affect the way women are represented. In the industry? In so the industry. So as actresses, producers, or just... Uh, well, well, you know, that, that, that includes producers okay. and the content especially. Okay. So okay. what are the things that inform the way programs about women, you know, movies about women. Movies about, yeah. oh, okay. And okay. for example, I think one of, you know, um, the current movie, F R Fumilayo, Ransom Kuti, for yes, instance. Yes, yes, I mean, it tells a lot about, you know, this powerful, you know, impactful, you know, woman. I mean, so what kind of lessons, what kind of things that, you know, inform the, produ I mean, you know, the producers to, to, to focus on kind focus. those kind of stuff? All right, all right. I mean, speaking to you earlier, we we're talking about the impact of movies, right, on society. Yeah. Generally, now from your experience so far, how vast would you say that influences? Oh, I mean, it's very huge. Mm. It's very huge. In fact, it can act as you know educational tool. True. You know, it can inform, it can educate, it can entertain, but largely, what people don't, you know, think a lot about is the the impact, there's a sort of way in which you watch, watch movies, you want to practice it. There's a sort of way in which movies can be used to correct the ills of society. True. Because, you know, in any movie produced, again, there's, you know, there's, there's certain intentions behind it. Yes. I mean, there's, you know, it's always about either with whichever way we look at it, about the good and the bad. Yes. And the good will always win. Yes. So movies, you know, is a very powerful, you know, tool of orientation. Of orientation. Okay, yeah. amazing. Now let's talk a little bit about your background. Before you got to this point, decided yeah. to come down to Nigeria yeah. to do this amazing research. What really was your core? Was your focus? Well, um, what was your background? Well, I mean, I studied, uh, you know, theater in my first degree. Oh, okay. My second degree, I studied uh, African literature with emphasis on theater. Okay. And then my PhD was in theater. Okay. So what I do uh, is I teach in those areas. Okay. But I'm especially interested, mm -hmm. again, you know, in disability issues. For instance, how Nollywood represents the disabled. Okay. And is that, that is that's a personal that's... story to that? Why disability? Well, what, what I found out is that, um, would I say, not, not, not in really personal, but what I found out is that, it is a lot of things that we, we you know, we present, we, you know, uh, to the viewers in movies, yeah. without knowing the impact. Okay, true. Um, for instance, uh, it's very common mm. to see um, the mad, you know, like I mean, I, you know, I, I research into how you know the issue of madness, for instance. Okay. In most movies, what we see mm -hmm. when someone is mad, rather than think about how to deal with them in terms of you know, medical issues, how to treat that, is usually presented as the result of, oh, serve him or serve her right. You know, it's usually this, you know, which as a consequence, as a consequence of yes, someone. So yes. it becomes a consequence of what you've done. Yes. So, uh, and I want to, you know, correct this kind of okay. thing. So, okay. Yeah. So, okay. so, so, so from, after, your, how long is your research um, on for? Oh well, I mean, the one I'm doing now yes. is just, is for ten months. For ten months. Yes, okay. and 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 it's it, you know I end up writing a book. 
Okay, so I was actually, that was actually going to be my next question. So yeah. now, so the, the results from the research now goes into a book. Oh, yes, the right? research, the aim is to, you know, to write a book on Nollywood and okay. again on, on this topic. And then another thing I do, um, which I started doing, is that I created a blog. Mm -hmm. which, which is intended to serve as a resource base. Okay. Because, the law, you know, again, Nollywood is, is a worldwide phenomenon now. Yes, it is. So my intent is to, you know, create this blog mm -hmm. that should serve as a database. Okay. So wherever I'm researching Nollywood, mm -hmm. anywhere in the world, okay. when they get into this blog, mm -hmm. They will be able to see, see you know, materials that yes, will help their that research. Will help them. Okay, is there, is there any provision or any thoughts being driven towards like documentary or probably like a film showing the journey so far to also like quickly transfer okay. the message? Well, well, what I intend to do, well, that blog documents that. That's yes, one and yes. two. I've, I've been conducting interviews with a lot of veterans in the field. Mm. You know, actors, producers. Mm script writers and these are these are people that they're normally not visible to the viewers yes, yes, so yes. again i've been conducting these interviews and i and my, I, my intention is, again is to package that uh, into a book i call it nollywood uh, conversations mm -hmm. so these are very interesting conversations um my journey Maybe, I mean, you're giving me a very interesting idea. I might, I might, <laughs> yes. might want to, you know, probably I'll do put that. that into, yeah. yeah, I mean, because, I mean, we're talking about the impact of movies on yeah. the society and things like that, yeah. right? And, of course, going through this, actually find out how people react to these disabilities, as you would like to put it, yeah. and then getting the results and putting it out there. I'm sure yeah. it's something that, I mean, even people that want to create movies yeah. in line of these things in we're researching about will definitely um, pull from the source. From you've the resource. And, and, and I think, again, um, you know, one of the things that I've done, like, you know, my, my research into disabilities, I've yes. actually published a lot in that. Yes. In different okay. aspects okay. of disability. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. So where where can we find those materials? I mean, you can find them in ResearchGate. You can find them if you go to Google Scholar. If you, I mean, again, they're in a lot of university databases. All right. Yeah. All right, so many amazing. Of them. Amazing. Thank you so much, sir. It's definitely My an pleasure. amazing one having you here with us. I My hope pleasure. you and wish you all the best Thank with you. your research. And I hope the 10 months are definitely more than what you've anticipated it to be. Thank, Thank you, you, you Professor Kola Olaya. And uh, that's it on this interview right now. We actually go on a short break. And when we come back, so, so much more happening right here on Wake Up Nigeria.